Okay, I wanted to start back here um, in the living area so you can see with the tree. I love that tree and it just makes the whole space look so nice. Um, we did a board and batten accent wall in our dining room. We actually had a carpenter do it that our builder knew, but I have seen a lot of DIYs with board and batten online. So if you wanna take a try at it, you could, but we, but we had this done by a carpenter. And we took paint from, where did we get this? Sherman Williams, I believe. I can find exactly what the paint color is and I'll link it for you guys, but we painted this. Now, if you can see on the video, I don't know if you can see, but it's a little bit shimmery, which I thought I would love, but honestly, I'm not loving it. So we actually got another paint that's more of a matte and I think we're gonna try to paint over it. So I'll let you know. What do you guys think in the comments below? Do you like a little shimmer or would you like it more matte? What's your style? So that's the first thing. Obviously it is so dramatic and I love it. I've been envisioning a really um, bright house with a really dark room for so long and I finally have it, which is so exciting. Okay, so next thing I wanna share these chairs. Are they showing up blue for you or black? Let me know in the comments below as well. They're definitely black, but for some reason against the black wall, they look a little bit blue. They're definitely black though. It's so funny. There's like a ladder over there. Um, ignore that, but they are black. They're black velvet and they have gold legs. They're super comfortable. And I'm literally in love with these chairs, except I hate when people say they look blue because they kind of do and it, it annoys me. But I love them so much. They're so comfy and beautiful. Also, we have cats and dogs, which love to ruin furniture. And then velvet's really good for that because our cats can't scratch the velvet. So that's really a plus. Okay, so next up, I want to share this blanket. How gorgeous is this? I've been just trying to throw cozy blankets that are also really beautiful and incorporate the colors I'm going for over chairs. And it just adds such a touch. Like, Look how cozy that is. I just feel like not only is it comfortable, but it's beautiful. Um, so I'll link this below. This is from one of my favorite brands on Amazon. I have so many of their pillows and blankets. Um, next up, I want to share the rug. How gorgeous is this rug? I was looking for a super neutral rug that had grays in it. And this one is just so pretty. It's really great if you have pets because any stains can come off very easily with this rug. And um, I'm gonna link this below. I believe it comes in like three or four color options. I just think it, look at it, it's so beautiful. It's very soft as well, um, which I love. This vase is so pretty and texturized, which is hard to find on Amazon. My coffee's here. Um, and I just thought this vase was so gorgeous. So I'm gonna link that. Now, the floral arrangement here, I actually mixed in like three different faux florals. I did peonies, roses, and then these little branches. Um, and then the branches aren't, they're from Michael's, so usually those are out of stock, but I can try to link them below as well. These peonies are from Amazon, and I'm obsessed. This is a cream white, and I also have them in like every color, pretty much. I have like all the pinks too. Um, but I like to mix in. Oh, there's even a faux hydrangea over here. If you mix different kinds of florals, you'll notice it looks a lot more realistic in the end, your bouquet. And it looks like something got on here. Um, so that's just a little tip for me for florals. Um, I am going to share, I don't know what's this little white stuff here. Um, I'm going to share my cup as well. This little mug is from Amazon and it's by the brand Dowin, I believe. Yeah, Dowin. It's just the perfect white little coffee cup. We have these in black that are a little different style, but I love the ridging on this one. I feel like it's the perfect size. I'm going to take a little sip. <laughs> and I just love that cup. This table, we get asked a lot about this table. And this is actually a Wayfair find. I'm gonna remove, or move, move this chair so you can see the bottom. How cool is that? It's like super modern, so cool. It is Wayfair. Um, it's from the brand I think called All Modern. It's definitely modern, but I love this wood. Sometimes this table goes on sale, so definitely check it out in the link below. I'm gonna, in the description box below, I'm gonna link it. But the wood is stunning. It's like, I love that they mix in the light and dark wood and this really cool pattern that goes down like a diagonal. It just really warmed up the space and it just looks so elegant. So love that so much. Um, the light fixture, my boyfriend Lane hung this yesterday for us. Look at that. You guys, we had, I can show you, over here, that's why this ladder's here. This was the chandelier that was hanging when we got the house. 
it's so lightweight and it's just nothing special. It just wasn't working for us at all. And then we put this one up and I had envisioned this look for about a year before we even moved here of a light just like this and I found it. So this is an Amazon find. I believe it's under 200 and we literally swapped it out on our own. It's actually pretty easy. Just look on YouTube how to do it. Um, my boyfriend mostly did it, but I helped him like by holding this and he had the ladder. So um, definitely recommend switching out light fixtures in your home. It adds so much character. And these bulbs are, um, hold on, this whole situation is dimmable. We don't have the dimmer yet, but let me show you the bulbs. So my boyfriend actually picked those out. Look how cool those are. They have so much character. I'm gonna link the bulbs as well. If you just did a regular bulb, I don't think this would be as cool, but he did those really cool bulbs. It just made it, you know? It just, like, look at this. It made the whole space just come together so nicely. So excited about that. So definitely gonna link that, the bulbs, and the light fixture. Okay, this is, oh, I don't like that showing. I might have to put something there to cover that outlet but look at this gorgeous little boucle sherpa chair so cute it has little wood legs it is so soft it has a nice curve which is really popular right now curved furniture is just so adorable and this beautiful pillow i wanted to get some more warmth in here besides just the wood table and so i added this i do a karate chop how beautiful is this linen pillow it's a throw pillow cover so i already had the pillow put it on there and it just adds a nice warmth touch in here. And it is also Amazon, it's so soft and beautiful. Now, if we go over here, the outlet's really bugging me, so I'm gonna go this way. If we go over here, you can see this gorgeous console situation. And guess what, guys? This console table is under $100 from Amazon. It's super modern and gorgeous. I have styled this a lot of different ways on my Amazon storefront if you wanna check it out. But it was easy to put together. I think it's like $90, and I just literally love this little table. Perfect size. I'm going to link the table. And then I have a record player here that I also got on Amazon. Right now we have a Bob Marley record in there going. And whenever we're not using it, I put all of the speakers, and we have a VR headset and stuff in here. Just hide them in this huge, beautiful basket, which is also Amazon. I will link below. Then we just have a few records here. We're planning on getting large bookshelves that will go to the ceiling on each side, but we haven't gotten them yet. We tried this small one. We were going to do like a double stack, but it was just too kind of flimsy, so we're not going to use that. But we're going to hang up a black rod, sheer white curtains, and then bookshelves up to the ceiling on the side. So that will be so pretty. Um, another thing on this console table that's from Amazon, well, everything is, this gold antique mirror. I've been wanting one of these for so long. It is just so, so gorgeous. This one goes in and out of stock, so check the description, and I hope it's in stock. If not, I might link a few similar ones. Um, the candle, super modern, simple. I love that it's just like very basic and nothing crazy with the text. And this comes in black and white, I have both. This is the jasmine infused bergamot, it smells so good. I love to have a good scent in your home. I feel like that just adds like a luxury feel as well. So that one, highly recommend. Um, this book, S is for Style, is literally, I'm gonna have to show this to you guys. It is one of my favorite home decor books. And as you can see, I'm actually looking at another one. I have been getting really into home decor books. Not only do they look beautiful on your tables, your coffee tables, your consoles, but you can just look through them and you get so much inspiration and it's just so much fun. This one is all about every interior design style. There's country, there's modern, farmhouse, everything. And it's just so colorful, so pretty, unconventional, lots of different styles. And then you can just literally open it up and set it on a table for a decor. So if you need a little more, say you need a little more um, blue, you can just put this out on a coffee table, leave it open to add a little pop of blue to your space as well. And also you just get so inspired with these books. I just love them so much. Um, and then, so this one, I'm gonna link below, S is for style. This one is like the tiger print. They also have one that's floral. And then this is another one of my favorite books um, for home decor inspiration. This is from the White Company. And it is all about white and neutral homes, which obviously we don't have all white here. We have a lot of black and brown, but I do love a good neutral home. So I get a lot of inspiration 
through this book as well. So pretty. Um, this little, hold on, I'm going to have a little sip of coffee. This is Pierre. This is my dog, Pierre. Say hi. We're taking our dogs to the vet here in about 30 minutes. So I wanted to just film this really quick first. They just have a checkup. And just to start getting back on their heartworm and flea medication since we just moved a couple months ago. So this little light is so cute. We actually have this hooked up to the Alexa. So right now it's on. Hold on. Alexa, cozy time off. Okay. There you go. And so it turns on or off. I can link that. That is literally this little situation. My boyfriend plugged in and then you can plug in lights and you can have your Alexa control your lights so you can have them turn on or off. You can name it cozy time or living room, dining room, whatever you want. I just thought this one was so pretty. It's like a sphere with this gold bottom and there's an on and off switch right here or you can have your Alexa do it. So I just thought that added a little something to the space. Now here's what it looks like without the book there. Just a little more simple. And then if we go over into this corner, how gorgeous is this? little accent table you guys again i needed to add a little more wood to warm up the space so this one was perfect because it has this really cool black detail on the bottom but then you have this gorgeous wood on top so this one goes out of stock quite often so check below i hope it's in stock for you this vase is like 14 dollars, you guys from world market i also found a few similar ones from amazon i'll link below as well i just love it it's so pretty and these are so pretty. I think this was like 30 bucks for this whole set of faux eucalyptus um, stems, which is really good. I have these in orange as well that I use during fall and like Halloween. But I just wanted to add in some more green for spring and summer. So you literally just throw them in. I just got these yesterday so they could be a little more fluffed. But like I just threw them in that vase and look how just organic and beautiful that looks. It's so pretty. Oh, this one's bothering me. So you can mess around and see what you like, but if you just literally throw them in there, it's gonna look good no matter what you do. So let me just give you a little span of the whole room once again. I think I linked everything besides my dog. And yeah, pretty much everything in here is Amazon except a couple items. So hope that you guys like this. Definitely give my Amazon storefront a follow as well. I post there daily, always trying to find new, fun, different items that other influencers aren't sharing just so we can, you know, switch up the game a little bit and be ahead of the trends. So hope you guys liked this and I will see you on my next video. Bye.